This bill has, it just replenishes the small business lending fund, the PPP, uh, for about $300 uh, billion or more. Uh, and uh, it has $75 billion for hospital uh, uh, defraying of costs and uh, $25 billion to surge testing. Uh, but it leaves out, uh, as you mentioned, all of the uh, very important measures uh, that uh, progressives have been asking for but haven't received. And now, uh, you know, Republicans got the small business uh, uh, replenishment that they wanted. And uh, it's hard to see what the incentive is for Republicans to come to the table on a, uh, on a fourth round. So why was it almost unanimous then, David? Well, uh, certainly, uh, I don't think anybody is saying that this money isn't needed. I, I think what, what uh, AOC and, and others are saying is that uh, they're disappointed that uh, this didn't have the, the key measures for individuals, rent relief, uh, uh, fixing the Postal Service, uh, uh, guaranteeing vote by mail for the elections in November, uh, payroll support and things like that. And, uh, you know, progressives that I've talked to are, are very upset that, that leverage keeps leaking out here uh, over and over again. You, you know, uh, in, in the last big bill in March, you had a, a giant corporate bailout. Uh, you had uh, now you've had the small business uh, uh, relief that has been put in uh, that that small is a relative term. It's 500 employees or less and, and franchises can still uh, apply. Uh, so, you know, that that's that's kind of what the Republicans wanted. And uh, now Democrats are going to try to get their priorities through. And uh, it's it's, I think, going to be a pretty difficult road. I think the key is that there's no real pressure on Nancy Pelosi. Uh, Nancy Pelosi has been a one-woman Congress uh, for the last month or so. Uh, she, uh, the constituents uh, or uh, the the other representatives have not been involved in policymaking. Uh, I'm told from one progressive uh, organization they're going to try to get members to say out front, give us some of these uh, demands that we need for our constituents or we're not going to vote for this next package. They want that, that guarantee up front to pressure Pelosi to actually include some of this stuff and work on, on a bill that actually meets the needs of, uh, of, of the, the American people, especially in these districts.